Hello my dear, it's Cora here again and this short tutorial will help you to design your mood board in Canva. We have already talked about that you will copy the master template in your own account so that the master template will stay untouched and you can design in your own template. So I have done this for you and if you see this first, for example, please make sure you make a copy of your of the master template. OK, and this is already a copy and I will then delete the information on the first page because you don't need this anymore by clicking on this little trash icon here. And what you hear, see here is the template I have created in Canva for you. The background is created, it's an image, it's created in Photoshop. But here are the yeah, drag and drop corners or squares where you can drop your images from your Pinterest board in there. So what you will do, you go to Pinterest Please go into your account in your profile. Uh huh. Here we go. And download the images. Open up, right click with the mouse save image as go to your mood board and save it there i have done this already and i will show you this example with the summer infused mood board template and what i will do now is going to uploads and i'm starting to upload the images i want to see in this template upload your own images. I have them on my computer. Here are all the images from my mood board I have selected. And you will choose background images, signature images, um, the expression of the emotion, pattern, or perhaps a graphical element, um, geometric forms if you are into the winter infused style or a brush kind of image or even a typographical expression of your style and um, yeah find find this composition of um, which which is exactly the color palette as well so you don't want to collect pictures which are from a different uh, color range, you will choose pictures which are coming together very smoothly. And what you see here is now my pictures I have uploaded and it's very, very easy now. I, I click, drag and drop the pictures into the designated spots. Voila! This is magic, isn't it? And I will drag and drop this in here. And in here, very slowly, give it a little bit of time. That's okay. In here, till it hovers over the spot. That's the whole magic of this template. So what's happening here? I'm not sure. Should drag in there. What does it say? Oh yeah, if you have any issues by by using this template, please reach out to Anna Darcy or to me and we will help you on your way. Oh, you see, and very, very specific. So what, what's happening here is 
perhaps I want to show the shoes so I can with the arrows on my keyboard I can adjust this image again oh yeah I have to confirm now what I have done I have um, oh good that we are talking about this I have moved the whole square but I only want to move the picture here it is let's see if it yeah so a little bit patient here but the template will help you to figure this out okay another picture here and I will put this picture again in here but I will choose a different perspective oh. And you see what when I'm clever I would say I start with her arm and I will <laughs> I will put her feet down here so that's the magic of it you have collected your color palettes or your color palette and these squares are here to choose or paste in your colors and because on your color palette there are these numbers as you can see here the hex code number and I will write this down here so that I have a reference E B D F E four the next one is A seven seven E A D, and uh, next one is five six four nine four C, and I will go back to Canva, click on this little square here, and then I go in here and say an additional number, and here is it so easy you can put in the code E B D F your number of course and confirm and there it is and the next square create a new color what was it I put in the digits and the next one So you will do the other two as well, but I don't want to stretch your time too much. And this is it. Uh, this is your new mood board or one of your mood boards. You can create more if you like, because I have on page two. Oh yeah. So let's see. It's a little slow now because of all the images in there. On the other pages, there are templates as well so now oh I have moved it to the bottom <laughs> anyway that's okay um, you can click on the other template templates here and drag and drop other pictures if you want or you can duplicate this with this icon and write your name this is my name here my summer infused um, brand styling template come on um cora spoladore and you will write something like mood board or yeah not so easy my amazing <laughs> mood board 
and your name please so when you share this on Facebook you can do this here share this if you share it as an editable uh, template then it happens that someone else could edit your mood board we don't want that um, you leave it as it is you could share your your open source link to someone if you want to collaborate with this person then you click on editable design but you don't want that you want to share with us your final mood board and you can do this by sending this via email directly to your inbox and then download it onto your computer and share it in the group or you can post it on facebook and share it then later in the group but the easiest way is to to send it via email or you can download it directly here as a png file because i have created more pages for you and in this case this template is on page three i will say download page three if uh, you want to have a transparent background i don't i would not suggest it right now white background is better and then say download and what's happening is saving your design to your download folder on your computer and then you can share it in Facebook as well with us and share your experience, um, share your amazing mood board with us. And we are looking forward to see, yeah, your new styling. And uh, that's for now. And I'm wishing you all the best till um, we can see your post.